I already, <laughs> I already hit it. Uh, <laughs> and we're live. <laughs> <laughs> How's the sound for you? Uh, good. Okay. I can like barely hear it, but it's background music, so I'm not worried. Okay, we'll see. I was gonna say maybe it'll be it'll also be louder when the yeah the dialogue. We did turn down music and turn up dialogue because I couldn't hear anything yeah. anybody was saying. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you called Andrew a hag. Yes. He followed. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Oh my god! His name is Commander Shrap. He said, okay, queen. <laughs> I turned off my follower notifications. Oh, there's Tabitha. Ready to heckle! Woohoo! Yeah, I turned off my follower notifications because I didn't want them on the YouTube version, but normally there's like a cat and it's holding a heart and it says, it's thanking you for following me. So, so cute. <laughs> just, just picture a cat. Holding a heart, a cute one, not a physical. That would be terrifying. Oh, sorry for a second. I thought you meant like a cute cat, not like a physical. <laughs> and I was like, what do you mean? I was like, I don't know what to... you mean either. I thought you meant like picture like a cute cat. You're like, not like a real cat. It's like animated, not like. Well, it <laughs> is a cartoon. Anyway, it didn't matter. Yeah. I like how Tabitha is blatantly there, but our screen still says zero viewers. <laughs> <laughs> like, Maybe she left. <laughs> actually, like, no. <laughs> actually, I've got better things to do with my life. Oh my gosh! I will have to leave again soon because my family is not eating dinner at eight fucking p.m. Andrew, oh, Andrew, I'm gonna revoke your mod privileges. I'm gonna, yeah, we're gonna heckle you. We're gonna heckle you. <laughs> Join. Well, we're listen, like, just come back when you're done eating, like you freaking didn't last time. <laughs> yeah, she's I'm here. here. That's funny. <laughs> Thank you, Tabitha. <laughs> This is fun. <laughs> this is fun. We have fun friends. Mm -hmm. We're waiting for more viewers to. to <laughs> Technically, we have to zero. Because right now, yeah, we have zero. We have two, but it's still it says, says zero. zero. Refresh. Mm. All that did was kill Aww. everybody else who was in here. Oh. Oh. There's what, also is, what is this? I think some of them are bots. Okay. <laughs> anyway. Interesting. Well, Andrew, if they yell. Tabitha. <laughs> <laughs> the rudeness of it all. Oh, we have like we texted our friends, Tabitha. Yeah, we're we have like, friends. We were we were not like hoping to build a following. <laughs> I know. We're, I'm hoping to at least have like three or four because I have three or four friends. I know. Oh, we always do so much better in front of an audience. <laughs> <laughs> no, we fucking don't. I mean, like, <laughs> I'll invite Jamie. I wonder if she'll join. Shut up. Jamie would not watch this. <laughs> So, you wouldn't. I I would watch you stream The Sims. And I would yeah. watch I'm saying you wouldn't watch you and I play <laughs> Nancy Drew right now. You've got better things to do with your life. No, I, don't. I don't know who that <laughs> Clearly is. Clearly I don't. <laughs> I don't know who that is, Andrew. And Sarah. She sounds like I don't a know bitch. who that is. <laughs> um, look, I still have my settings for when we, when we <laughs> stay tuned for danger. danger. Because I was too lazy to type out Midnight in Salem, so this just says Miss, but this, it's like, stay tuned for danger. Okay, do we want to go ahead and do our, we want to go, do you want to go? <laughs> do you want to fucking go? go? <laughs> do you want to do the thing? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what? Oh, wait, do you mean the talking thing? I don't know. We just want to, we wanted to, like, recap, because Andrew left, and yeah. what's his name wasn't here. Commander Shraff. <laughs> yeah. Commander Shraff wasn't here. Um, arson, <laughs> historical homes, teenagers, Salem. Salem. <laughs> witches, both real and fake. And I would say alleged. Alleged. <laughs> AW, uh, accused witches. Accused witches. A stolen book that was meant to, uh, what's the word? Um, the stolen book had the list of accused Yeah, witches. it was like meant to like repair right because um it's the list of the accused witches it's to like, so, like if you help. Could track your ancestors yeah that, 
in that yeah. book, then you could receive yeah. reparations. And it was originally written by a guy who was a judge in the not this not the American Salem witch trials, but, but Salem witch trials in Austria. Austria. Mm-hmm. And he wrote them to atone. That's the fucking word I was trying to find mm-hmm. because he believes he was wrong, and so he wanted to like make up for it by like here are the people who who I have for like apology yeah. letters. But it, we were sent. We were already in Austria, and our dad asked us to pick it up, and then it got stolen. And the person used a smoke bomb, and that weird fake witch also used a smoke bomb. Yes. The same smoke bomb. Um, we've met... The person who's accused is... May. May. And she has a burn on her face from an event that happened when she was a kid, and that's why everybody thinks she did the arson, but they're also way too quick yeah, to jump on it. There's no actual you evidence tell to support that, that May has done anything. They just want this to be done. They're just working on, like, yeah. past... So we've met May, we've met uh, her older sister Tegan, mm-hmm, who works um, at the museum. Their cousin Deirdre is a is a Nancy Drew frequent character. Yes. Who kinda hates um, Nancy, but yeah, like I said, Tegan, frenemies almost. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she doesn't she like Ned? And that's like Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Deirdre lives that's I mean, it's two girls in a work of fiction. Of course they like the same guy. Of course. And definitely. then we've also met and we're so we're working together with Deirdre, and every time we turn around, she's fucking two oh, inches from our God, face and it horrifying. horrifies me. And then we've met um a defense attorney we've met the judge on this case and we've met we're about to meet we need to meet the old caretaker of the home yes who is also also a shop owner and who was also the caretaker of the old woman who used to live there who died and nobody investigated her death because she was 88 right and then but there's been serious uh implications by some of the characters that they should have looked into it yeah and nobody lived in that home at the time but i think the caretaker still lives in like the house that's I was on say, the I think premises. She does, right? Yeah. Because they were just like, well, I don't like know where help, she is. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. And um, the only person we have left to meet is her. And then we also, at some freaking point in time, the Hardy Boys should be in this game. Hence the name of the stream. Because <laughs> they were the in the concept Boys. art and they had really good outfits on. And I'm upset that I haven't seen them yet. I know. I want to see the Hardy Boys. Um, they friends. What else were you thinking? I suspect that the judge is being... Oh, yeah, something's up with the judge. Because he was like, uh, somebody broke into the evidence room. I wanted you to do something for me. And she's like, have you called the police? And he was like, oh, oh shoot, no. yeah. I probably <laughs> should do that and not talk to a teenager. Right, girl. and he was also being, like, super cagey and weird about, like... There's no like, evidence yet, you know? Like, pushing back when we were just like, hey, maybe you shouldn't just go ahead into this thing thinking that May did it when there's no evidence. Simply because she's that. got some Zuko scars. And he was just like, um... Trust me, this is what everyone thinks. And we're just like, that's not... That's not how evidence works, Mr. Judge. And and Nancy's got, like, kind of rightfully, like, you're a bad judge. Like, how dare you? But also, like, five minutes beforehand, she (laughs) was really annoying. Nancy was like, blue lives matter. Oh, my God, that shit was so embarrassing. She said that... She told Deidre, like, if you committed a crime... She was like, of course I would turn you in. What do you expect? And then she immediately picked a lock. Mm, She was like, I'm a lawyer's daughter. I (laughs) love that. That works. Which, which for lawyers, despite the fact that law is in the name, everyone, yeah. uh, all two of you, we had to talk over dinner. We were like, we were like, this isn't how this works. Lawyers, how lawyers are not are law enforcement, enforcement like officers. They are just there. They argue a point, whether it's correct or not, mm-hmm. specifically so that you can find the trueness in either point. Like, exactly. their role is to say, like, this person's innocent, even if they know they're not innocent. I was going to say, if lawyers only ever stood up for people that were correct, then we wouldn't all be entitled to one. Exactly. <laughs> in a court of law. So. I've played a lot of Ace Attorney. And I watch a lot of Law & Order SVU, so we So we've got, we've got enough patchwork knowledge to know that this is not how you're supposed to do As this. As someone who's seen Legally Blonde more than a handful of times. As someone who's played um, one, two, three, four, five, six, six and a half Ace Attorney games. <laughs> That's yeah. a fucking lot, so that, actually, now that I say that number. <laughs> they're long games. <laughs> so, all I'm saying is that Nancy was being really fucking annoying and hypocritical, because also... There if are anyone, spinoffs. There's only six Ace Attorney games, but there are spinoffs. That's how I've played six and a half. <laughs> if anyone else has played one of these Nancy Drew games before, and I know or Tabitha five. has, because she is my sister. Hi, Tabitha. Um... <laughs> <laughs> um then they know that all Nancy does all the time is break the law. <laughs> we stole stuff on like day one. She breaks and enters into places. She impersonates. She 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 does all of the crime. Nancy is an absolute criminal, but she only gets away with. Anyway, it I think we covered everything. Stupid reasons. Yeah, I'm ready to play. Me too, but I just had to yell about Nancy being. Nancy's a baby. I was like, what is this dialogue? This writing. Why would though. she say that? Okay. I don't remember why, but I wanted to talk to the lawyer. Okay. Yeah, we're in the town hall now. We just there finished. she is, yeah, Deirdre. Deirdre. <laughs> hey. So, how did your meeting go with the judge? It was dope. Informative, but he's not telling us everything. Don't worry. Come back tomorrow. He'll be in a better mood then. Okay. Are you Carson Drew's daughter? That I am. How could you possibly guess that? It's 
the hair, isn't it? <laughs> no. I see him in you. It's more than just looks. I didn't know you and my father knew each other. Know him enough. If you need any help, Nancy, please feel free to ask. Dope. Good night. Good night. Is it night time? <laughs> Did she say good night? Yeah, she said good it's night. Late in the afternoon. I think presumably the evidence room will be back here, and we did notice that there was a security camera, and that at some point we'll probably need to check that. Right, because I'm sure that we're gonna find the. Hey, footage. Deirdre. Because I've played a Nancy Drew game or two. In I, time. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna find the tape, and Nancy's gonna watch it. She's probably gonna Why say something like, "It looks like it's been edited," you know, like, and <laughs> it's gonna be useless. But we are gonna have to do it. To the right. Okay, I can't go like other places. Dope. Okay, cool. All right, let's head to the museum. Yes, I want to go on that tour and also just look around the museum. Not excited to read, but I'm excited uh, to I'll look read. at things. Justice delayed is justice denied. A W. group is really chanting up a storm. What has them so angry? Can we talk to them? We can't. I've tried. We tried last time. Ugh. We could only talk to this person who sounded like she was across the room from her microphone. <laughs> yeah. Um, that's not the right way. No. And this, how do I get out of here? Oh my god. Dude, you're, you're literally bro. so thoroughly in my way. I, I remember now, you can only go through there. Take the witch door? Yes. Yeah, I would recommend it. Here, okay, we'll just take the fucking long way around the hay bales. Is that even really the long way around if it goes straight there? Oh, true. And we tried to talk to all these people, and we got what we got. Alright, museum time. go to a museum right now in real life oh oh that's that horrified me look at this oh she's spooky i saw goody proctor with the devil accused of being a witch Aww. these were ordinary people just like anyone else hmm. may history remember the wrongly accused may history never again never again be repeated okay wrongly accused freaking may Right. <laughs> They're just like, hmm. This cute little raven is, is little cute. Raven. I don't know if it'll become relevant at some point. And we've got this fun new 3D rotation technology. Yes. The figure of a Puritan woman accused oh. of being... Oh, <laughs> Deirdre. De people, just like any... Hey, Deirdre. <laughs> oh, you get a little mole by your ear. That's nice. I like her earring. Yeah, I like her earrings, yeah. Can I, like, Can view this on a 360? Anywhere? Wow. Oh, it stops there? Can we not, like, go to that corner? I can. I'm just in a, um, in a viewing mode right now. Okay. And I just wanted to see if I could rotate the lady all the way around <laughs> for no good reason. Thank you for watching my stream. That'll be it for us tonight. <laughs> uh... You know, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah. The carefully researched genealogy of several accused witches. Their names weren't fully cleared until 2001. Wow. Is that true? Talk about procrastinating. Uh, probably. I don't imagine that this game would rotate. <laughs> I don't imagine that this game would just make up some bullshit. They, they, always, they tend to do their research. Yeah, I was wondering because, like, I it made me wonder about the reparations. I was like, was that, like, a real thing in Salem? If it you're, might like, have been. the descendant of an accused witch, is, was there any sort of reparation program for Close that? Off. Oh, Looks like this they're hallway. preparing a new installation. Ooh, that'll be mm. fun and creepy and cute later. All right, let's talk to our to to Tegan. Hey, girl. Hey. Hey. Sorry about the mess. It We're looks in the middle of installing a big showcase. Normal. So, what have you seen in town so far? We oh, decided you know. to do the real witches tour. Oh. You talk to Olivia. What's with her getup? Witch? Street magician, maybe? Everyone has to make a living. Is she telling the story about a coven living here in the recent past? That she sure was. Yeah. Why? Just bad taste. <laughs> Olivia is quite the local character. I hope you don't mind if we do the tour. I want to see more of the town. And finding out a place's old superstitions is kind of a habit I've gotten into. <laughs> Sarah always yells at me for clicking the pen. I do. I do. I'm like, <laughs> Comment in the chat if you can hear the click of the pen. Hold on. If oh, I got a tour ticket. Oh, wonderful. And a pumpkin. <gasps> oh my god! 
I can carve the pumpkin. I get to carve a pumpkin. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, oh! We get to, okay. We can. Okay, okay. We get a tall one. Fuck the mystery. Oh, <laughs> this oh, this is a good. This is a. Good, I like the tall shape. I quite. And oh, that's I like the, the traditional. I like the classic one. You want to go? Tra- we could split the difference and get this. This one. Click a lick. Yeah, he can. He can. He, <laughs> Not lick. <laughs> he can hear the pen. Okay. Oh. I, do you want to split the difference and go a kind of fat tall one? Because I like the tall one. Let's do the tall one then. Okay. Because I, I like. I only like the original, and I only like the tall. Okay. <laughs> the middle one leaves something to be desired. Oh look. We get so many options. Sad eyes. Ooh, Spider-Man eyes. I like the spider man eyes. Oh! <laughs> I like the little open eyes. Too. Classic. I want to do the happy eyes. Oh, I mean, I know we cool. haven't seen all the. Ooh. Ooh. A little demure. <laughs> a little sexy. A little tired. That one's let's sleepy. Do the, let's do the happy eyes. Okay, let's see what mouths we like. Okay, yeah. And that's just. True. We, oh, well, let's nose. Oh, so we nostrils. could literally. We could. I. This looks like Voldemort. Voldemort? Yeah, I was just going to say. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, this is like a little dog nose. It does look like a dog nose. Okay, bye, Andrew. I don't know what you're talking about. Andrew, I'm gonna text you at 8:30 on the dot. Be like, <laughs> I know you're done eating. Back. That one looked like a little bat. Wait, which one? That one. That is like cute. an upside down heart. And then there's a dot. Hmm. I like the nostrils. <laughs> you like the nostrils? Starfleet <laughs> uniform. Yeah. Puffy. And that one's like a. I can't even. Like see. it's going to the side. I think. Okay. It's hard to see. And the bat. I like and the circle. I like the circle. Okay, let's look at the I mouths. Aww. Is he not the cutest? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Aww. Ooh. It's a little spooky. I don't, I don't like, like that, that shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that shit. Oh, I like that. Not for this guy. He's yeah. too cute. But I like that. Like. Like, I'm writing that down for yeah, when for, October comes well, around. We need to make a, a really spooky one. This I'm assuming we'll get to make more than one. I like the crooked. I like it, too. I think it's Carved. perfect. Carved. Done. This looks great. Oh, did it, like, go to our inventory? Find a nice place to put it. <gasps> yeah, we're fucking doing it again. <laughs> oh, we, should, we can't while well, this one's in our inventory. Okay, okay. Well, noted, Later. guys. <laughs> we have found our new favorite mini game. Oh, there's another candle. Cute oh, lantern. thank you. That's it so is cute. cute. <laughs> okay, so where is that other one? Is there just only one in the in library? This, in the in the museum. Where is it? Oh yeah, it's on the library. Um, there. Oh, on so the desk. It's on the information. I desk. don't know if that'll be relevant, but I feel like the fact that we can interact with them, like we see them, when we and go, we go, huh. hmm, yeah, and that they're all around, it's the same design. It yeah. makes me think that they're going to be relevant. So I went ahead and started making a list. What do you mean, let's see? Just frickin' pick up a flyer and read it, you goober. Let's see. Let's see. Sarah. <laughs> I, will, I tried every flyer, and I was wondering why we can't... We're just looking at Can them. we not? I mean, we could do it again. I don't... <laughs> no, let's Oh, not. my f- headphone said low battery. We might have to play it, the, oh, the... the thing out loud soon. That's weird. I even put them in the little case today, because I thought that, that would help them charge. The case might be low as well. Ooh sad that even children are named in the list of those accused witches like abigail johnson just 11 more like pump and carving simulator with some unrelated side quests That's yeah right, abigail also did you like your shout out in this mm. game <laughs> right when and right when she t- said something in the chat too okay these things are saying low battery at me a lot so okay so we should just go ahead and sorry if this goofs the, the audio audio price. but i don't think it will because oh. it didn't last time. Okay. Then we I mean, like, it'll definitely, like, you might be able to hear it, but it wasn't, uh... Annoying. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, see, the case is also low. The Salem witch trials were a tragic time when those accused of witchcraft were not only adults. The hysteria and accusations implicated even the youngest in Salem, the children. Many children were accused, tried, and put into prison. In 1692, Abigail Johnson, at the age of 11, was one such child accused of witchcraft. Her mother, Elizabeth Johnson Sr., was how has she seen i guess she could have siblings was also accused of witchcraft in the trials abigail lost her father just two years before the salem trials and she was being raised by her mother and grandfather okay so going for the unconventional family Mm -hmm. i see you the trials were known for the accusing of many widows and people who had been in trouble for any number of reasons especially those who may have had relatives who were outspoken against the trials or came from a position of wealth interesting usually i feel like they target they target poor poor, yeah. yeah maybe it was kind of a case of like 
getting their fortune. Yeah, that could be it. Such was the case for young Abigail. History notes that her grandfather was an early critic of the witch trials and was known to be outspoken about the injustices of the trial's proceedings. Abigail and numerous members of Abigail's family were accused of witchcraft. That's a very easy way to get rid of your opposition. Really and truly. Hey, I don't think we should be accusing people of witchcraft. Oh, a only a witch would say that, you know? It's very much like the Red Scare, the 80s. I don't <laughs> I'm like literally this guy. just thinking of that. <laughs> I don't like this guy. He's a communist. And everyone's like, get him out. Get him out. Yeah. <laughs> For Abigail, uh, the examinations were known to take into account members of the families from any of the accused. For Abigail, this included her mother, her sister, and one of the more famous persons accused in the trial, her aunt Abigail Faulkner. <laughs> aunt Abigail <laughs> Faulkner was arrested around the same time as young Abigail and accused of afflicting others, resulting in her confession. For Abigail Johnson, this time in her life was a long series of examinations, accusations, trials, and depositions. Her aunt was arrested on August 11th of 1692. Her testimonies resulted in an arrest warrant being issued for young Abigail Johnson on August 29th, even though she was only 11. Abigail's widowed mother was also arrested. The Johnsons were arrested and examined on September 16th, shortly after Abigail's brother was arrested. Other family members, including her cousins, were examined and are recorded as being among the young children who were accused witches of Salem. They said, fuck the Johnsons. Really, truly. The trials appears... The trials appeared to have embroiled suspicion and accusations whether n where neither family nor child were spared for implication, questioning, and arrest. For Abigail Johnson, while both she and her family were arrested, none were among those who were executed. Still, the accused who were imprisoned suffered from poor conditions and loss and the loss of friends and family. There shouldn't be a comma right here. <laughs> After the trials, Many of the accused were known to have petitioned the courts for payment for their losses and asked for the courts to clear their family names. The family of Abigail Johnson, who were accused of witchcraft, included her brother, Stephen Johnson, and her older sister, Elizabeth Johnson. I feel like this family is going to become relevant, like oh. somebody's the descendant of this family. I feel like you're probably right, because why else would but there's an about them? There's two pages of, of Abigail information. Johnson information. Yeah. The fear of dark evil spirits possessing the people of Salem, both the old and the young, caused a hysteria resulting in 20 people executed and over 200 accused of witchcraft. Sadly, the hysteria started with accusations that actually originated from young children when Elizabeth Paris, age 9, Abigail Williams, oh, different Abigail, Abigail Williams, age 11, claimed to be possessed by the devil and blamed local witches for their actions. Ironically, the first accusers were children. Their accusations became the spark that led to young children even younger than Abigail Johnson to be added to the growing list of accused. Again, shouldn't be a comma here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, when the children who were accused of witchcraft were arrested, like Abigail Johnson, they endured pain while kept in what locals called the witch jails. The children accused and arrested had cold and dark walls in the prison with rats and little food. Oh. Dorothy Dorcas Good was the youngest child in the, tri in the trials. She was accused when she was only four. How would you even? That's so that's you wouldn't even have you wouldn't even have the motor skills to perform <laughs> witchcraft. That's what I'm saying. She was the youngest. You can't see over the cauldron into your potion. <laughs> she was the youngest among the accused and had to spend eight months in a prison dungeon. The trials ended for little Dorothy, but her mother Sarah Good was later executed. I specifically I remember the Good. I was gonna say I felt I that studied them in really in an American literature class. Anyway. The little children accused of witchcraft in the Salem witch trials suffered and are always to be remembered as we, as we honor the accused. Cool. Right, and Abigail in our chat said every time I hear my name, I'm like, hmm? And then realized oh, it's God, a different There's more. Those are so okay, well, this one's only one page. Okay. Uh, oh, Professor Hotchkiss. Isn't that the same professor that we always call Hotchkiss. in these games? Maybe. <laughs> Roger Codnett founded Salem in 1626 as a colonial town, which was first called Nomkig. I don't know, for the settlement's location at the mouth of Neomkig River. <laughs> the settlers wanted to call it Salem, inspired by the Hebrew word for peace. Huh. Well, they didn't get much of that. Yeah, Despite the peaceful irony. beginnings as a settlement of immigrants, Salem is best remembered for the witch trials of the 17th century, the deadliest witch hunt in American history. Yep, I knew that. England had their own witch trials, also in the 17th century, and had passed a witchcraft act, making it the law to put anyone who practiced witchcraft to be put to death. Mm. Clunky sentence. Yeah. Shouldn't have had put... This is what happens when two copy editors play <laughs> yeah. a game that involves reading. But also, somebody somebody copy edited this. Yeah, but... Did and they, they didn't do a great job. <laughs> I was going to say, the, the commas uh, after certain phrases make me think that they were just like, the accusations, comma, 
I like there used to be a, a prepositional phrase there maybe that they took out maybe and then maybe it just and they didn't, didn't and, yeah, yeah maybe that's the bible from 1692 until 1693 over 200 were accused the court of oyer and terminer w- was established by governor william phipps to interrogate the interrogate those accused of the work of the devil witchcraft phipps and his active duty go- deputy governor thomas danforth both men of positions and wealth appointed judges to preside over the trials one of the harshest judges on the accused was the rich and powerful magistrate judge john hawthorne hawthorne house hawthorne house is the name of the house that got burned yes, down that was his, that's his that's his property. home hawthorne's examinations and interrogations relied on spectral evidence and it has been noted in history that he often judged with an assumption of guilt like our current judge mm-hmm. lots of repeating ourselves here many believe the accusers often gained in wealth and land rights from their accusations and sentencing that was solely based on spectral evidence after the dark period of the trials, laws were changed and Salem's shipping and merchant economy grew. The settlement became a place of assembly for officials during the War of Independence. Many luminaries hailed from hailed from Salem, including noted author Nathaniel Hawthorne, born in 1804. So that's why I keep accidentally saying Hawthorne. Yeah, I was going to say, to be fair, Hawthorne and Hawthorne are so... Very close. Mm-hmm. And are those the only lots of famous read? people yeah, named probably. Hawthorne. Yeah. Street art. Wait, insane. street art. Oh yeah, I was I was like, let me get back. I didn't see what that was. Um, there's a gift shop. I want to. <laughs> I want to go to the gift <laughs> shop. Right, I'm like, I want to buy. My, I want to buy stuff. My fake gifts. Okay, let me look at our to do list. Yes. Check. Go on the tour. Okay. Uh, that's it. Cool. Interesting. Let's go on the tour. <laughs>